Hey guys, my name is Kimberly, aka Sunkiss Curls on Instagram and YouTube, and I've partnered with Curl Mix to bring you guys my nighttime routine. Okay, so first thing I'm gonna do is go ahead and do my skincare routine. Um, my skin has been like pretty dry around this area, so I'm gonna go ahead and do a moisturizing mask. Hopefully that works with the dryness <laughs> and the little flakes. And I'm gonna show you guys everything that I use. And I also bought some new items, so I'm excited to show you guys that as well. So first I'm gonna go ahead and cleanse my face. And I'm gonna be using the Urban Skin RX, which I just bought like a week ago. So I've actually been loving this. It hasn't been too harsh on my skin. So I'm gonna go ahead and use this. It comes with this little, this little bar that I thought was just like some extra that they left in there. But actually when you wet it, it um, foams up and it turns out to be like a little sponge that they have in there for you guys. This is what the sponge looks like. If it will focus, it turns into a little sponge. So I'm gonna go ahead and rinse my face with some water and then wash my face. Now that I've done that, I'm gonna take that um, Urban Skin RX cleansing bar and I'm gonna go ahead and put that on my face. And my neck as well. After I do that, I'm gonna go in with my Foreo. I'm gonna go in with my Foreo Play Plus. And I just dampen that. This is my Foreo. I'm just gonna go ahead and turn that on and then close my skin. Okay, so as I've said, my skin has been like really dry and stuff, and I haven't really had like a facial brush. That's why I went ahead and purchased the Foreo Play Plus. Um, this was, I believe, $50. Yeah, $50, and I got it from Ulta. And then it has a button in the back, which makes it vibrate, and that's what the little bristles are. It helps you cleanse your face. Um, so yeah, I just got this one instead of buying like the regular Clarisonic. They do have different sizes, but I just wanted to test it out, so I got this tiny, cute little one, and I've been loving it, actually. I've needed one of these, so yeah. So for my mask, I'm gonna use the Freeman Anti-Stress Clay Mask, and it says it instantly clears pores and balances for renewed skin. It's a 10-minute mask, so I'm just gonna go ahead and leave that on for a little while, and then rinse it off. So I'm just gonna leave that on for 10 minutes and then I'm gonna rinse it off. Okay, so I just went ahead and rinsed my mask off. So now I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and finish my skincare routine after I let my face dry a little bit. So I'm gonna go ahead and spray my face with the Mario Badescu facial spray with aloe, cucumber, and green, green tea. But yeah, this is what I'm using. I'm just gonna go ahead and mist my face with that. I'm gonna let that dry for a little bit. It's really refreshing. As well, if you guys haven't tried it, I just got like a little small travel size one. Feels really good. Next, I'm gonna go in with some aloe vera gel. Um, just because I've told you guys my face has been like a little dry. And I don't know, I live in Florida. 
but the weather has been like all over the place so it's a little cold right now i'm gonna just like mainly focus it around this area because that's where it's been like the driest so i got this aloe from amazon it's called real aloe jelly and it's unscented so i'm just gonna go ahead and put like a little bit of that on my face So I like to use the this clarifying tea tree beauty oil with vitamin E that I found at TJ Maxx and I need to re-up on because it's almost gone. I'm just gonna apply like a little bit, a little drops, a drop to each side and my forehead and then just rub it in. My face literally feels so moisturized. Then I'm gonna go in with the Face by Camille Rose and this is their Daily Brightening Moisture Dew. And I'm gonna go ahead and apply that a little bit to my face. Okay, so that's it for the skincare routine. So I did just wash my hair today using the Curl Mix products from their lavender section. So I'm gonna show you guys how I prep my hair for bedtime. Um, Normally I just put it into a pineapple and then sleep with a bonnet on top of it. Um, if you have like, you can put your hair into a pineapple and then if you have like a satin pillowcase, that should be fine. At one point I had like all three because I'm like a really crazy sleeper. Right now I just got like this really huge bonnet that my husband calls a chef hat and I just put that on top of my scarf on top of my pineapple. So I like to take my scarf, and I got this from a beauty supply store, and I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what I do. I'm gonna go ahead and flip all my hair to the front. I'm just gonna go ahead and tie this into a knot. Like this, tie it into a knot. And tie it at the back and then you just put your bonnet on top so this is what it looks like this is my little chef's hat that I got going on and I'm already in my pajamas so I'm gonna go ahead and go to bed I normally go to bed like around nine ish o'clock I try to go to bed early because I don't really have a choice my body just likes to go to bed early so I'm gonna go ahead and get in bed and show you guys what I do there. So after I do all of my skincare, I like to go ahead and get in bed, grab my phone, just kind of scroll through Instagram for a little bit, just kind of, you know, see what's going on in, on the gram. And look who it is, Curl Mix. And yeah, I just like to show love to some of my favorite people. And after that, I go ahead and turn on some TV to watch until I fall asleep. Um, don't know why I keep watching Grey's Anatomy. I don't know if you guys like it, but it is very heartbreaking. So yeah, that's pretty much it for my nighttime routine. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and YouTube at Sunkiss Curls. And yeah, thank you so much Curl Makes for this collab. And it's time to go to bed. Good night, you guys. <laughs>